What's going on? We're back with the Boxing Clinic and more. Y'all know what it is, man. It's your boy CJ Goodfellow back on the Boxing Grind. And, um, you know, according to my sources, Tom Loffler told the media last night um, that, you know, Canelo had, Golovkin has stepped off his 50 50 demand. He stepped back to a 45 55 split. That's what he demanded now. That's negotiations. You shoot for the moon, you're still amongst some stars. But guess what? He was trying to play, he was trying to negotiate with the wrong mofos, man. At the end of the day, he got stripped of that IBF and he got that mind right a little bit. You know, that IBF gone. You know? Now he see him him being stripped on uh him being stripped for the WBC on the horizon. All of a sudden now his demands are coming down. He crawling back to Canelo once again. At the Oscar said, oh, we done with these negotiations. Playing negotiations one on one. And that's why it's important that you got a really good team around you. And I know second rate K two promotions that don't nobody give a shit about. You know? That's imperative if you have a good team. And, and you show, you seeing why to have a good team. Because Oscar De La Hoya is playing bully ball out here. You know, it's like Draymond Green trying to guard Shaq out here. Man, it ain't going to work. And um, I see Abel Sanchez. He was mad in the interview. I didn't really catch the interview. They seen the title. He was mad. And he said, Canelo go run to Jacobs and this and that. No, you go run. You run to, to Jamal Charlo. You know what I'm saying? But now you want to run back to Money Bags. Money Grams, Canelo Alvarez. Now you want to come back to Canelo and, and with your tail between your legs once again and, and the, the, the man is 64, uh, what, a 55-45 split. 45% to you, 55 to Canelo. Just to clarify. Now you want to come back. Oh, Mr. Canelo, man. I was just playing, man. I'll take a 45-55. I'm Canelo Wilder. Nah. Nah, little nigga. You, you take that same. You take a 70-30% for my inconvenience, you know, and, 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 and having to answer questions about you. You take that 70-30%, man. You're going to take 5% less. You know, and treat this dude like the like the, like the the motherfucking hoe he is, man. That's the word for the morning. Hoe. For boxers. He's a hoe. They love him. You know, at the end of the day, I let his ass fry, man. You know, I let him fry. Since he talk all that tough shit, I ain't a draw, I ain't this, I ain't that. Go draw by yourself. You know, go go get that WBC belt up because you don't want Jamal Charlo. You don't want him. You don't want to fight him. uh uh-uh. You know, come see me next May. You know, after you fight two more bums, you down to one belt. You know, let me let me talk to you next next May, man. Cause I'm not about to bail you out of this situation. All that shit you talked about me being on Clint Buterall, me juicing. You know, you pushing Nevada State Athletic Commission suspend suspend me six six months. And you know, you at the you at you down there with Nevada Nevada State Athletic Commission with your lawyer and your team pushing me to get suspended. You didn't want to see me winning. You didn't want to see me on top. But in the same breath, you turn around and say. I still want to fight Canelo Alvarez, even if he juicing or not. No, nigga, you've been talking cash shit. I'm not about to give you. And I'm not about to give you no opportunity to make this money. You gonna make a million dollars versus whoever bum you trying to fight on HBO. From Canelo Alvarez, I take that hard stance right now. I'm telling Oscar the trainers left the left the motherfucking building, man. Now he want to get his mind right when he getting stripped the belt. Let that motherfucker get stripped of the WBC belt too. Strip him of his total boxing dignity. He's a fraud anyway. They can say what they want to say about me. I cheated or whatever it may, may be. I'm the A side still. He can take a 70 30 split with me right now. You know what I'm saying? 70 30, or you keep it moving. You know, I need my 5% back for all the damages that you caused to my career. But you still want to fight me, huh? You know, I make I make this nigga fry, man. For real, man. Golovkin is such a such a prima donna. You know, he probably getting a pedicure and soaking his, his, little, his fingers right now. It's a pussy. You know, he tried to sell this big Billy Badass persona that that he was he really wanted all the smoke. That nigga ain't want no smoke. He want the money. He want the perception that he a Billy Badass. He been pricing himself out for years. Abel Sanchez mad because they got stripped. But you don't need the belts. But you was down there for five six hours with WBC with the IBF trying to sanction that violence March Rosian fight. When you could have fought Shevchenko on May fifth. But y'all thought y'all continue to do what y'all want to do. Y'all thought y'all was Floyd. Y'all thought y'all was Cotto. You thought y'all was uh, Canelo. You thought y'all was Sugar Ray Leonard. No, nah, that just proved that the IBF stripped you. You ain't shit. You know, could have went for Undisputed. And you ain't want to go for Undisputed. You know, this this is good for boxing. You know, people say, well, well they can't beat him. I mean, anybody can whoop his ass. I'm trying to tell y'all, man. If, if he was unbeatable, he'll fight anybody. He wouldn't let his belts go. And now we're on to the WBC thing. And, of course, he's trying to call back to Canelo because WBC say if you fight Canelo, you know, you get to keep your belt. You know, if you don't fight Canelo, you got to fight Jamal Charlo. And, obviously, he ain't trying to fight Jamal Charlo because he wasn't even trying to fight Sergey Shevchenko. So, guess what? He in a fucked up predicament. He ain't no cash cow. He ain't shit without his belts. You know, and he going to be down to one belt. Nobody going to give a fuck about him. 
You know, he's going to be a beltless fucking uh, Triple G. He's going to have one belt just to hold his pants up. So nobody got no hard feelings for him. And I ain't saying that Canelo Alvarez is right in any situation. But at the end of the day, you got to know your position. You a bottom bitch in the sport. You're not, you're not synonymous with boxing. People don't say boxing and think of Triple G. That's Anthony Joshua. That's, Triple, that's Canelo Alvarez. You know, people think about those guys. Floyd Mayweather, Cotto. You know, guys like that. I mean, it's a couple of fighters back down the list. So they get to you when you talk about boxing. You a guy that's been a fraud your whole career. I've been exposed to you from day one. You ain't fighting nobody. You fought everybody that was tailor-made for you. And when you had to stop out your scope of support, Kell Brook kind of chin-checked you a little bit. Then, then, then you thought Danny Jacobs was sweet like an apple pie from McDonald's on Tuesday. Then he, then he really whooped your ass, and they, they, and they gave you the favorable dog because they, the, they wanted to see the Canelo fight. Then you fought Canelo, then you came up short. What do you say versus Canelo? If I don't get the knock, it was, it was, it was saying, say, say, we don't get the knockout, it's on us. So don't come back crying. You said it was on y'all. I could put an article up. And in the perfect world, he deserves 60-40 split. But since all this shit happening from Oscar, he get the same, well, he get the same, uh, he get the same 65-35 split, man. Same split. Take it or leave it. You know, you ain't no draw. You ain't even got a belt. So that knocked 5% off right there. You, you, you one belt less. You know what I'm saying? But like I said, man, a lot of people won't understand. They trying to act like this dude is some shit. Man, he wants shit. WBC, get the strip in this motherfucker, man. Y'all know what it is. TBC, it's your boy Goodfella. You know, speaking that real trill box and talk, man. Like I say, man, it's time to strip this guy, man. Strip him again. You know, this motherfucker gonna be out here with, with a motherfucking, uh, with a ball begging for change and, and Big Bear. I used to be a, a three-built champion in middleweight, man. Nah, I gotta beg for change. But y'all know what it is. We gone.